My name is Keith Bergthold. I'm the executive director of Fresno Metro Ministry. Our mission is uh, learning, connecting, and engaging to achieve healthy people and healthy places in Fresno. And it kind of begs the question, where do you invest in Fresno to really create health and prosperity and wellness across Fresno? We asked ourselves that question for a long time, and we kind of came up with sort of a metaphor of a body. If Fresno was a body, we might think of downtown as being the heart, and you might think of Blackstone Avenue as being the spine. Pretty important for the whole body, for the spine to be healthy, right? But Blackstone really isn't as healthy as it could be. Lots of urban decay and marginal businesses and some pretty poor neighborhoods where people are challenged to live a healthy life along Blackstone. So we came up with an idea called Better Blackstone a couple of years ago, and it's starting to catch on. Uh, there are a lot of people, a lot of institutions, a number of businesses that have joined a thing called the Better Blackstone Association. And we're starting to work with individual owners as well as groups of owners and people who just really care about that spine of Fresno being healthy. And we're concentrating in four areas right now that we think have a, a geographic leverage to them. We call them activity centers, places where you could go to work and live and play and inter be entertained, real places that are destinations in Fresno that might then, as they grow and flourish, become catalysts for the rest of Blackstone to be healthy and prosperous, and maybe the best, the rest of Fresno to be healthy and prosperous. Those activity centers are Blackstone and Shaw, Shields and Blackstone around Manchester Center. Center, Walden and Blackstone around Fresno City College and Olive Avenue, which is the kind of the gateway to the tower. So we're really focusing now on those geographies as places where new mixed-use development could be served by the new bus rapid transit system that's coming into town and a number of other things. So I hope you'll kind of drive up and down Blackstone and think about places instead of just driving 55 miles an hour to get to wherever you go and think about maybe stopping sometime and looking around and what could happen here? How could this change? How could more apartments be built? How could more businesses with restaurants be there, places to shop that would really be fun and be connected by that new BRT? Hey, thanks for your time. And if you want to learn more about Better Blackstone, just go to www.betterblackstone.com. Uh, if you'll join and let us have your email, you'll know about every single event we have on Blackstone and we'll keep you well informed.